Did you even notice I was gone? Well, I hope you did. And uh, I'm back to uh, start some more videos. I've had kind of a busy few weeks. Um, and last week I had to go for an MRI of my brain. If you didn't already know, I have problems seeing um, ever since I had COVID. Um, I see like five or six of everything and my vision is very blurry and it makes me um, have headaches and a bunch of other issues, it makes me nauseous um, when fast things are going by and such. So I had to go have an MRI and uh, I can't just go have an MRI like normal people do because I have a pacemaker. So um, I had to have special people there and they had to set my pacemaker to 100 beats per minute. And um, I'm not sure exactly uh, why that is. I guess they it's just easier to monitor, who knows. But uh, anyways, um, so they adjusted that and then um, I had to have an IV put in and because I have a connective tissue disorder, uh, I told them then they're like, oh, we'll be fine. She stuck me once and couldn't get it. And you ever have blood work where they take the needle and they dig in? Well, they did that for a little bit and then until I start getting irritated with it. And then they switched to this one and she tried to do this arm and then she's like, I got it. And I look and then she walks away. And then uh, I see her bring someone else out and then some guy uh, right above where she did on this arm uh, got it. So after three tries, I got an IV in and then that's for the contrast. And then um, they uh, put some uh, little sticky things on with wires and a heart monitor. And, uh, and then they lay down on that fun, flat, hard as hell table. <laughs> and uh, then they put a little bird cage type thing on your head. But before that, um, they give you these little earbuds to listen to music on, and they ask what you want to listen to. I said, anything but country. And um, so uh, they put those on, and then they put another big pair of headphones on your head to kind of dry, drown out the banging noise the MRI makes. But they play the music so quiet that it's like, if they were playing music, you couldn't hear what it is. So I don't know what the point of that is. And then anyways, uh, they do all that, push you in, and 40 minutes later, I was finally done. And then um, I got to go home, and then I've been busy with our animals. We have, uh, we, we've had for a bit now four ducks and three chickens, and we've trying to prepare them for the winter. And that's uh, been interesting. Uh, one of the ducks kicked me in the hand and injured my finger for about four days. I had major swelling in my thumb and uh, pains that were just horrible. So anyways, it's been going away. So I finally figured I'd sit down and try to do some videos. So uh, today we are going to be opening the final two boxes of SpongeBob we have. And um, I recently started working with some companies to promote their products. So I will be doing that soon. Um, it's mostly cards. Um, some I'm really looking forward to, and uh, some will be down the road at some point. And um, I do have a bunch of Disney different series. I know I have Zootopia, um, a new Stitch set, and a Toy Story set, and uh, geez, a bunch of other ones. But I'll discuss that in another video. Today we'll go ahead and check out these. Um, so, uh, I thank you for uh, waiting around to watch my next videos and uh, let's go check these cards out. All right, so this is going to be the last time you have to see my dirty desk. I uh, bought a new thing, a uh, piece of wood to put out uh, onto my table so that it won't be such a glare and everything and trying to uh, get things smoother looking. So we're gonna go ahead and open these. Um, I've, I almost threw these away because I thought they were the ones I had already opened and forget I had two more. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad I didn't do that. But uh, I've, I've been really looking forward to see what else we find in here. I'm just going to go ahead and take all these out of here. And um, we'll put that one for last. Um, I'm really excited to get a lot of the new products I talked about. Um some of them are really, really nice, um, and uh, they are some f official, and I'm not 100% sure on all of them, 
Um, I prefer supporting people who actually have official products than ones that aren't. Um, but these are pretty incredible cards. I just wish the people um, whose art, etc., they have used actually got paid for them. So um, I'm going to put all the special ones in the pile. And then, um, as you can see, there's one of my... I was going to wear a glove, but I'm like, I don't need to be a dork. Um, I already am one. So, um, but yeah, I this healed, and then I got hit again. You can still see the big lump right there. Um, that was uh, very painful for a while. And uh, yeah, so I got to watch. Be careful picking up ducks. Um, who knew? But they're starting to get uh, to, to know me better. Um, it's funny because uh, we actually brought uh, the three chickens in the house and we sat down with them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make this easy on myself and just cut the tops off. Um, I um, We brought them in and my, my wife, myself, and Jordan um, sat on the couch and we held the chickens. And they um, they actually fell asleep in our hands. So that was really, they kind of cuddled up and just laid it, it, their heads on my arm and, and went to sleep. So I thought that was pretty cute. Um, but there's a, a cake, crusty crab key, number 10. I don't, like I said, I don't remember, this one does look new to me. Um, I don't remember all of these, but um, yeah, the, the, the chickens are starting to... Um, be more friendly toward us. I've been trying to spend time with them. And it's funny because, well, we had to put, um, we we only put a few of the cats away at first. And then we ended up um, having to put them all away because um, we didn't want them um, going after the chickens because they were pretty interested in what was going on. But um, it was funny to, uh, the, the cats probably have no idea what the heck a, a chicken even is because... Um, our cats, most of them, have never been outside before. Um, this is a cool one. I don't think I have this one. There's, geez, already we got the, didn't we just see that? Oh, it's, it's Patrick. Oh, that's interesting. So there's that. Um, I still need to get, I hope it doesn't go out of, um, I'm sorry I'm skipping through these so fast. Um, I'm hoping I'm, I'm able to still... I don't have a lot of funds right now, so um, I really want to try to finish my other SpongeBob set that we started, but um, I've got other things I have to take care of, like bills, um, medical ones, which I still am trying to pay off. Um, why are these all like backwards? Um, but uh, I do want to finish that f one of the first SpongeBob sets we have. Uh, not so much the inserts, but um, just the base cards. Um, I only have a few from each thing. Um, eventually, I'll I'll sit down and, and share with you which ones we have gotten so far. I'm pretty sure I already have this one. But uh, I am looking forward to a lot of... Oh, I even have cards coming from um, Elemental. Uh, that was actually a really good movie at first. I, I stopped watching it when I started watching myself, and I'm like, eh, so I don't know, this just seems weird. And then I sat down and watched it with my wife, and it was actually really good. And so I have cards coming from that. Um, oddly, they're they're more like the Wide Vision cards, um, so I will be getting those at some point. I don't think they've even shipped yet, um, but I'm looking forward to those because it was a really good movie if you haven't seen it watch it um it was it's quite interesting um but it was fun i haven't watched a really good disney movie in a while i like that one it's really cute um but uh yes i'm by myself tonight my wife has to um go have a second sleep study she has um she snores all the time. <laughs> Sorry, honey, for uh, dissing you on the, on the video. There it is. I'm pretty sure I don't have this one. This one is cute, especially the time of season it is. It is the SpongeBob Halloween one. When he, and everyone thought he was dressed as a mattress. <laughs> the haunted mattress. 
But uh, these look like a lot of, ooh, I would like that. Um, and like you, you might have not heard me in the other video, I found out after seeing a few friends of mine artwork on here um, that they were used without permission, um, which is unfortunate, but I don't know. Even if it was my art that was used without permission, I'm sure I would probably I still get these because either way, it's it's done. So there's Mr. Krabs. The only thing is they kind of cut off the artwork. It's kind of weird that they do that. And if you're wondering what this is, I had to look it up. Unfortunately, some of these not so licensed um, products um, don't have a lot of information about them. So this one is supposed to be plankton as a human, pretty much um, like an anime type version. And then they have on the opposite side would be the regular plankton card. So if I can find the match for these, I will show you at some point. Um, but uh, yeah, a lot of these are... I just It's so crazy that so many of these are... Um, all refractors, pretty much. And another SpongeBob and Patrick. Um, actually, I have a bunch of stuff that we're actually going to do an entire video just of Spongebob stuff. Um, I got a bunch of merch from uh, Five Below and some other things, and I found some old stuff. Um, like I said, I was, I've was i always been a big Spongebob fan. Um, painting my kids' room Spongebob and everything. And um, I found a bunch of things that once were the boys, my older boys who are now in their 20s. Um, so I will share those at some point. Uh, now I'm starting to, I think we're getting dupes here. Interesting. That is the unfortunate thing I did notice on these. Some of these you really get a lot of dupes. And I do not like that. Especially when you're trying to finish a set. That's a new one, I believe. I think I need the lower numbers. Um, I might just give away some of these other ones or anyone else who is working on any of these sets. I will gladly trade with you or whatever. Um, so those are all our base cards. And then the, oop, that one is supposed to be over there. My bad. So these are all, we'll have to look for those later and separate them. So we're gonna move on to our Next box, we'll open both these pink packs at the end. Let's go ahead and finish working on these. Um, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to... Oh, and, and my... Uh, oh, this is a really nice card. Look at that. As I was going to say, Star Trek Lower Decks just came out. And um, they're really, uh, really nice. Oh, here we go. Okay, so here is the Plankton card. Let's get these other base cards out of the way. And then we will go back in here and dig out. There he is. Alrighty, so it goes like this. And then you have the human version of Plankton. Look how beautiful these cards are. There's so much going on. It's crazy. I'm also working on trying to get some um, SpongeBob sets and some other ones from different countries besides just China. Um, so we'll see what we can do about that. But this is a great one. This is really cool. I'm not sure what that's actually from. But it's very cute. I like that one a lot. So hopefully we can get close to finishing the set. At least with the new um, new other Disney ones that are official. Those are, uh, they're by Kakawao is the name of the company. And um, they have a list of everything. So I'll know. Look how that spiral, can you see that on camera? There's spirals in here. Look at that. And then there's regular rainbow and everything's going on. It's crazy. But uh, these are nice cards. 
Especially, like I said, every one of them is a refractor. But, um... Oh, this is interesting. It's, you don't usually get this on the top. Ooh, there we got another one. At least we're getting these kind of hard to get ones. So we need that one, I know. I don't think I've ever seen this one. And Alrighty. I would love to have worked on a SpongeBob set doing sketch cards for SpongeBob. If someone's out there and they need to, has a US license, they need to do that. That would be a lot of fun. Look at that. We, so I know what these are from. This is the camp, the newer camp show with uh, SpongeBob as a kid and then the rest of his friends. This is in Spanish. That's really cool. What does it say at the bottom? No, it just says Stephen Hildebrandt. Alrighty. Tomorrow, <coughs> excuse me, tomorrow I gotta get up early and get Jordan on the bus. Ooh, we got more. That's really cute. I really like those. Those are nice. Fast and Furious. That's kind of funny. Scare or be scared. Ooh, more Halloween ones. Cool. That's so bizarre. She looks like a potato, not a sponge. Ooh, we got more. This is scary. That's a cool-ass Halloween one. Look at that. Look at that. That is sweet. It's freaking bats. Anyone know that meme? If not, you're old like me, but I still know what that is. That is cool. It's like... Uh, all the parts that are um, like of his body are have this really cool blue foil. I will say it's a very impressive, even for not. I mean, I guess that's why they get to use it. Um, it doesn't make sense though uh, economically because in the U.S., like I said in other videos, this would be extremely expensive to do all this. So um, I mean, yeah, I know it's printing in China, but still, this stuff is. Um, I mean, I know they're not paying the artists, so that's why it's not so expensive for them, I guess. But uh, still, <laughs> oh my god. But yes, we're doing really well here with the inserts. Uh, I'm pleased with that anyways. This is badass. I love that rainbow stuff. So cool. Alrighty. Look at that. I don't know if we need this one. Christmas Spongebob. I could open these all day. I should, if I, uh, I need to start getting, seeing you guys who are following these or watch my videos. We should get together on some, buying some cases of cards together. Wow. This is incredible. I mean, it's even more awesome in person. Oh, sorry. I'm a little far up there. That's so beautiful. It's pretty. Patrick Stahl. That's nice. More Fast and the Furious. But yeah, if you guys are ever interested and want to get on some of these box breaks with me, let me know. Because I'd love to uh, open some with you or for you. And uh, then we can help each other out with any cards we are looking for. I think that's more helpful than... People who just do breaks to make money off people. That's not my goal. My goal is to have fun and um, open new and fun things with you guys. And um, help you out if you need something. So, if you are interested, let me know in the comments, please. And I would like to welcome some of my... I have a someone, at least I know, who's watching my videos in Netherlands. So, that's cool. I like to know where everyone else is from. Um, and it's another, we did really well in these. It's another Sandy, Sandy Cheeks. That's really cute. And these are so strange. But there is a Patrick. I believe that one's Patrick. Oh, yes, it's Patrick Star in it. All right, we are down to the last ones. The pink packs, these are numbered. 
So we'll go ahead. Unfortunately, you only get one. Seems wasteful, doesn't it? This pack just for one card. I know you're probably cringing, afraid I'm gonna cut one off. Uh, all right, we'll do it this way first. It is numbered 210 of 300, and drum roll. Here we go. It's Easter SpongeBob. SP short print. Look at that. Wow, there's fireworks in the background. That is insane. Dude, these, they, you know what? Someone, I'm surprised that what they haven't done yet. Um, I did find one on eBay, but I don't think it's real. And if you don't know what I'm about to talk about, there is, and I did mention it in another video, there is a episode of SpongeBob and Patrick trying to collect cards. And one of them is a Barnacle Boy and a Mermaid Man. Oh, that sucks. Um, and they say buy more cards, but it's a hologram, like a lenticular card. And I'm surprised no one has done those yet. That's an actual official one. But look at all the fireworks on that. That's insane. It's almost like it's realistic. It's going to come out of the screen at you. That is dope. That is really nice. Unfortunately, the stamping comes through. See right there? You can see it. Um, I guess it would kind of be better if they would have just printed the numbers on. But that's a badass card. That is very, very impressive. I guess either. I'm just easily amused. All right. Let's see. Last one we got. All right. This is 207 of 300. And here we go. That's cute. It's a little baby SpongeBob. Um, and little meow, Gary. That's very cute. I wonder. Oh, that's Camp Coral is the I think this is what this is from. I was like, that Krusty Krab would be KK, not CC. But but this is an issue I've been finding on these cards. That's irritating. But um yeah, that Easter one is is very impressive. I really like that card. Unfortunately, it also has a slight dent right there, see? So you can never get these graded can anyways, I'm assuming, because they're not official. But that is a badass card. 